Okay, I'll just show you how to delete a mobile from this 2015 Range Rover autobiography. Um, so any screen, you see there, you've got please connect phone there. So it's showing it hasn't, uh, there's no phone available. If I click please connect phone, it brings up the phones that are already connected or are already paired with the system. That's my phone, Barry's iPhone 13 Pro, and I want to delete it, delete. Delete Barry's iPhone 13 Pro, yes. That's it, gone. Okay, I'll just show you how to pair a mobile to the Bluetooth audio system in this 2015 Range Rover autobiography. Um, okay, I'll just show you how to pair a mobile to the Bluetooth audio system in this 2015 Range Rover autobiography. Uh, first of all, we need to make sure that Bluetooth is on, like so. Then we're watching out at the bottom. And uh, if we go over to the system, please pair phone or telephone. If we click on telephone, same thing either way. Search new. Now you need to wait. Here we go, vehicle to device, we'll do that one. You need to wait. Sometimes it shows up on your phone, but you need to wait till it comes up on the screen first. And I'll show you for why. If you tap on it on the phone before you tap on here, it, it doesn't allow you, it doesn't allow the system to, to generate a um, random pin code, right? So it's up here. So click on there, Barry's iPhone. To pair and connect phone, enter 8983 on handset. There you go. By now, this has come up 8983. That screen comes up automatically. Allow contacts and favourites to sync. Allow. Just taking its time. We'll keep it. I've got. I've got about four Range Rovers uh, <laughs> paired to this. Oh, there we go. Range Rover connected there. It's still thinking about it on the unit. Phone connected. That's it done. Okay, I'll just show you how to play music from your phone through the Bluetooth audio system in this 2015 Range Rover autobiography. Uh, first of all, we go to music. Look, see there at the bottom, Range Rover. If I click on that, gives you the choices that you can connect your, your iPhone to at the moment. Range Rover, there's a tick next to. So we'll go back, we'll go back to the track. I'm gonna turn it down, click play. And then we go head over here to the audio system. The music symbol and the clapperboard, we click on that. That's, I mean, I'm gonna do it, I'm, I'm just gonna show you, you a different way really, because it was already on Bluetooth and we don't want it to be already on Bluetooth because then you'll not know how to do it if it's not. So, right, we'll go back, we'll go back to home. We click play on here, it's got Range Rover on there. So if this is set properly, anything that's playing on my phone will come through the Meridian sound system in this vehicle. And the Meridian sound system is brilliant. So what we do now, we go to the, the music note and the clapperboard, click on there and you'll see there auxiliary selected. We don't want auxiliary, we want Bluetooth. So now source plus, and I'll, I'll just, again, sometimes you go to source and the plus isn't there. So you have to click source until, it, uh, <laughs> until it's done one function and then click source again and the plus will be there. So there you go. So it's on auxiliary, I want Bluetooth. There you go. So I'm gonna turn this up and then turn this up. That's it, that's how you play music. Okay, I'll just show you how to set the sat nav in this 2015 Range Rover autobiography. Uh, from any screen, this is the dual screen, so I have to be careful here because sometimes from these cameras you, you can't see anything. You can only see it from here because the passenger can see a separate screen to the driver. It's a real clever system, but we'll click on sat-nav. That's it. Is it showing? It's showing sat-nav on both, but if I click that, there you go. If I click that, you'll see what's on TV there, uh, but over here you'll, you'll see the, the sat-nav. So, I'm going to unclick that so we can just see that from both screens the dual screen is, is switched off over here we go to destination entry you've got postcode pick from map and previous addresses we want postcode we're Grosvenor Garage Blackburn Road High Walton Preston P R it's defaulted to numbers 5 4 E 
PR5 4 EA, that's OK, so we click OK. And now we have to click Go. Destinations nearby, please check the map while we're on the forecourt. That, that's it.